Hello Geeks! In this video we will set up Windows 10 to a virtual hard disk for dual boot. No partitioning or virtual machines are required. First, a short disk part script to create VHD. Next, a batch file to run disk part and deploy Windows. Mount your preferred Windows 10 ISO, check the drive letter it gets. In my case now, ISO was mounted as drive I. Edit the batch file to point to correct install.vim or install.esd file. Set correct edition index number and set boot menu description. See video description for Windows 10 edition index numbers. Save the batch file, open an elevated command prompt. Run the batch file. First command in batch file runs disk part with the script. When done, deployment starts. New Windows installation will be added to boot menu. We are done. Windows has been deployed, in my case now, to a virtual disk W. The VHD does not have to be mounted. You can unmount it manually or wait it being automatically unmounted by next boot. Next time you boot the PC, you will see that VHD was added as default OS. Select it to let system finalize Windows setup. Type msconfig in run prompt and hit enter to open system configuration and change default OS to your preferred one. When you no longer want to dual boot to Windows on VHD, simply remove the boot entry and delete the VHD file.
that's it thanks for watching